it, for me, um, you know, personally, it's you know, I, I, yeah, family. I, mean, I grew up you know, watching the game. Um, you know, kind of as an OU fan in the last few years, uh, as an OSU fan, and um, just all it, you know, it's all everybody talks about. Uh, you know, my family, and so you know, my cousins have been like, hey, you know, I can't believe I'll, you know, I'll be watching you. you know, they all went to OU, and, and so it'll be kind of weird for them to, to see it. And, and so I'm definitely you know, really excited about it. I have a cousin that, that goes there. His name's Ty, Ty Robinson. And he he told me, at least he told me a couple of weeks ago, he was going to be in the student section wearing orange. So he's pretty brave. He said he's yeah, he's, he's pretty brave for being there. It's pretty much just split uh, down the middle of my my mom's side all at OSU, my dad's side at OU. Uh, and now, you know, you're kind of slowly seeing my dad's side kind of, you know, oh, you yeah, know, it doesn't matter to us, you know, we like both. <laughs> so uh, it's, it's kind of funny to see you know, them starting to wear, wear orange and go out and buy those shoes. Oh. I mean, it's different. I mean, there's, all, there's definitely a lot of arguments about. You know, most of the time it's, it's jokingly, but uh, you know, it's kind of fun to chime in and, and, and say what, what you think. And uh, so, I mean, it, it's, it's kind of fun. Though. I had fun with it. Definitely, my mom. She, you know, she came here and you know, she hasn't backed out from anything. I mean, she, she gets in a fight with one of my, you know, somebody on my dad's side. You know, she, she won't, you know, she won't lose the argument. I'll just say. <laughs> I can't remember what year it was, uh, but you know, my, me and my my brother and my dad were watching the game upstairs, and then I had two sisters and my mom were watching it downstairs, all rooting for OSU. We were rooting for OU at the time, and so uh, you know, they they'd come. OSU would score. My parents would, or my mom and, and sisters would come up, you know, doing the wave and, and you know, kind of like taunting us in our face, and we were actually kind of mad. I don't know if they knew that, but we were actually really mad. <laughs> Um, I mean, maybe maybe a couple more, you know, people on my dad's side coming to OSU fans, I guess. Um, it was kind of, you know, maybe my sophomore, uh, junior year uh, when I was started getting recruited, uh, just realizing that, you know, I, I got to look at maybe other options. Um, you know, I always dreamed, you know, growing up to play for OU. Um, and then that kind of switched, and, and I realized that OSU was, was you know, up-and-coming program and a great program as well. You know, I was offered uh, actually under Miles, um, went like early, early December uh, when he was still the head coach, and, and um, I think it was Coach Mallory was my recruiting coach and, and Coach Gundy, and so. Um, you know, they offered me then, and then you know, I kind of just stuck it out. I was kind of committed to K. I was still committed to K State, but still kind of looking around at some other places. And then once Coach Gundy got the job and brought in uh, Coach Fedora, it kind of just kind of sealed the deal with me. I came on a visit and just fell in love with this. Yeah, it's it's going to be a big game. Um, you know, I've always you know dreamed about playing in, in this type of environment and uh, down know you and. And so it definitely be, you know, kind of a dream to come true playing playing there, and, and uh, if we get a win, that'd be, that'd be that much better.